Okay, with the electrical power measurement system, you can expand the capability of the hardware to do much more than just measuring voltage and current. You can also use it to measure uh, part of the environment around your power measurement system. Uh, with the additional modules that are included, you can do such things as temperature measurements, uh, sound and vibration measurements, or maybe even digital control. So what we've done is we've set up a system to show some of the basic functionality that you can do. Uh, we've got a drill here where basically using a temperature input module or a thermocouple input module, we're going to be measuring the exhaust temperature coming from the drill. We've also got a microphone set up around the drill head to measure some of the sound quality coming from the drill. At the same time we're going to be measuring uh, the power coming from the entire system. So what we've done is we've set up a virtual instrument inside of LabVIEW, our graphical programming language, uh, where basically we've got all these measurements set up and ready to go. So if I run this system, what we've got is a few different graphs. You can see on this temperature graph here, I've got a graph showing the temperature that is coming out of the exhaust of the drill right now. If I actually touch this thermocouple, you can see the temperature is going to rise. In addition, I've got a power graph where what I'm doing is I'm reading the voltage and current coming from the entire system and you can see the phasers down here, or the phase angles. In addition, I'm also measuring the sound coming out of the drill head. So what we're going to do is we're going to run the drill and show you kind of the change in the overall sound that we can see from the system. So from this system you can see that we're taking some sound quality measurements while we're still actively taking power measurements along with reading the temperature. And that's, some, uh, that's an example of some additional functionality that you can get from the electrical power measurement system.